thoughts on the game first, Jim? Good point. Good point away from home. Um, last game of the season. Motivation is um, certainly not at a premium for both sides. Um, in terms of things to play for, anyway, we've already been, already been relegated and now we've got nothing really to play for. So, at, in some moments, an end of season feel in some moments, but um, some other very good moments as well. Uh, please take a point, please do not lose again. You know, another game um, that we didn't lose in. Um, Shame he couldn't have hung on, just a bit disorganised for, for a moment. And um, I think I think we, we began to look tired in the second half. And being honest, and it started to show kind of how short our squad is at the moment. I think um, without real options to, to, to help the pitch out. Uh, good point though overall, yeah. And uh, brilliant goal we scored. Really happy the goal we scored. Uh, don't know how many passes that was, but. Please, someone count them back for me because I'd like to see that goal again. I haven't seen it yet. It seemed really enjoyable at the time. And we could have had more. We could have had more today. We could have, we could have been a bit better in some moments. And, and certainly the first half, I don't know if you recall, the final pass, I think it was on two occasions where it looked like, well, we're in here. We're clearly in. Then we were a bit wasteful with the final pass. Um, but, yeah. I've gone on a long time about that question there, but that's, that's ultimately what I feel about the game. So where to now, Jim? End of the season, we know how much you'd like to... Well, I know you've got a coaching job for next season. You'd like the job, where do we stand with that? What's the situation? Have you been interviewed yet? Are you going to be interviewed? What's happening? Um, I'll let you know when I know. I don't know. The chairman has said, though, that internal and external candidates are going to be interviewed. Have you spoken to you about that yet? I'm aware of those same lines and pretty much that only. Um, I'm aware that the club wants to do a thorough process. Um, I think that's good. I think the club should do that. Um, I, I, I'll be part of that. Um, but that, that's a, you know, in official interview format or not. Um, we'll, we'll get to work straight on that now, now that the season's done. Um, it's partly my doing because every time the club have attempted to speak to me, I've said no, not yet. I want to, I want to focus on the next game. So um, the club have been, you know, giving me well, I, granting my request in that regard. I've always just wanted to focus on the next game and focus on the players. I know the club want a head coach. I know that's what they want a head coach, and I didn't want to get along, um, get involved in all the political drama and. He's staying here, going, who's coming in, he's been interviewed, he hasn't, I don't care. Um, I've not been wanting to get involved in any of that, I want to focus on football, I want to coach the players, I want to make the players feel good. I want to get results for the fans and we've had eight games, we've had six results. No one would have said we did on that, no one. So, um, happy with how it's gone and I'll be speaking to the club in the coming days um, and the club yeah, will, will do their processes and interview. Um, the right amount of people and, and they'll make sure that they're happy with the decision that they make. Let's take it piece by piece. You want to be involved with this club next season. Would you like to be involved as head coach? Yeah, certainly. And you're going to be part of the process. <laughs> it's almost like you're going to be part of the process of choosing the job that you might want to go for. No, I, w I definitely won't be part of the process of choosing it. That'll be uh, you know, a board decision, that'll be totally a board decision. Um, but I will take part um, in a conversation with them when it's my turn to, um, which I presume will be in the coming days. Um, as I say, I've kept that at bay for now. That's certainly not the club's fault. I, I, I told the club I wanted to concentrate on the football and they've done um, a diligent process, I believe, um, with candidates externally and, and uh, internally is obviously going to be myself. So, uh, in answer to your question, do I want to continue the good work that I've already started, the good punch return that we've already got with what we've got in a really tough situation, in what's been difficult at times, hostile. Um, I'm, I'm really pleased and proud of what we've done in that time, so no doubt in my mind that I'd love to continue that and, and help the club get back to where I know it can be and how I know it can be and what our team can look like, so yeah. Let's finish on a positive note. You had 600 here today, they applauded you off the field. You've got a lot of players still on contract for next season, so you, you would know the sort of squad you're going to be working with. So that, that, something positive. Definitely, Peter, yeah, and of course I've thought about that, of course I've had those thoughts, of course I've gone through planning for myself, 
um, in terms of what the job would look like, what the squad would look like, what the team can look like, what we need. I've done all that. Of course I have, yeah. Um, because I love doing it and, I, and I'm really proud um, of, of the job I've been given for the last eight games. I've, I've been really proud to be the head coach. I've really, really enjoyed it. And it's definite positives, Peter, yeah. We've finished really positively. Points for 10 eight games, really positive. We've got some great goals. Um, today's goal, fantastic. Advert of, of good football. Um, things can only get better.